Setting up limited accounts for your family to use is easy in Windows XP. Firstly, open up the control panel by going to Start, Control Panel. If your control panel is in classic mode, switch it back to the regular mode by using the menu here on the left. Now choose User Accounts. The first thing you should do is set a password for your account if you have not done so already. Click on Change an Account. Locate your account from the list of accounts and click on it. If your account is already password protected, it will say so here, you can close this window and skip this step. If not, click on Create a Password. Now, enter a password for your account. Then enter it again here to verify it. We recommend that you use a stronger password than the one I'm using for this example. You can also optionally enter a password hint here to help jog your memory if you forget your password. Remember that this hint can be seen by anyone, so don't use anything too obvious. When you are done, click on Create Password. OK, great. We now have a password protected account. Close this window. Now, let's set up an account for someone else. Click on Create a new account. Now, Enter the name of the account. Usually, this is the name or nickname of the person who will use the account. Enter a name and then click Next. Now, choose the type of account you want to create. For children or anyone else who doesn't need to change system settings or install new software, please choose Limited Account and then click Create Account. Good, the account is now set up. Let's close the User Accounts window and the Control Panel. Now, I'll log off my account. As you can see, I can now select the new account we just created. Logging into the account, everything will be set up as default for the new user to use. If they wish, they can also create a password, the same way we did for our first account at the start of this tutorial.